Thank you very much. Yeah, an, an amazing result, really. Um, yeah, we knew he had good good form before we left Switzerland, and then obviously with his uh, his flying two hundred meter time, then we we saw what he was capable of, and I think uh, psychologically he realised he was he could be a big player. It didn't quite unfold in the sprint that way, unfortunately, but when it came to the Kieran, then he knew he was one of the strongest guys in the race. So it was great, great result. If you have to describe Jair, how will you describe him? Uh, easy going. <laughs> um, he's, you know, he's good to work with. He's, he, he, he thinks about what he needs to do. He'll challenge uh, the training that I set him. Um, so, you know, he's just not going through the process robotically. He's actually, he, he wants to be involved in the decision making and uh, un understand why he's doing the training that he is. So, yeah, he's, he's good to work with. So you are very satisfied about him? And is there much more potential in him? I think so. He's only been with us for the last two and a half years, really. So, uh, and... I wouldn't say he's even in his prime yet. Uh, a lot of, especially track sprint athletes, they'll come into their prime uh, closer to 30. So I think by by London, uh, sorry, by Paris uh, Olympics, and he could be red hot. And, you know, he's already one of the favourites and another three years with us in Switzerland, and who knows what he's capable of. Okay. Uh, you know uh, that he there is a difficulty regarding him going further because financial aspect is very difficult. Uh, so if he will not be able to go further with you, how will you say that, what will you say that will be? I think it would be a tragedy for, for cycling. I think we're, we're just kind of so bored of seeing the big nations like uh, Great Britain and the French, you know, they're kind of those the superpowers of cycling, I suppose, if you like. So to have riders like like Jair from Suriname, like Nico and Quasi from Trinidad, to have them come in and disrupt the whole the whole setup, I think it's really healthy for the sport. So it would be a real tragedy if, if Jair was was unable to continue, especially if it was just down to uh, something as simple as finances, which yeah, sim simple on paper, but uh, the reality is, is somebody still needs to pay the bills and. I think for peace of mind and all the rest of it, he, it would just uh, it'd make his training life much easier if he didn't have to worry about that that aspect of it. And um, finally, what is the criteria to come to Switzerland and be a part of uh, your training uh, camp? There, there is no set criteria. I mean, our main remit is to to help people that are in exactly Jair's situation. So. They, they've got potential. They maybe just don't have the infrastructure in the country they live in, or you know, we um, we try and assist those who maybe are, don't have the best finances. So we have a tiered system uh, with the with athletes depending on which nation they're from. So then you know we can um, top up this the support or or help them with uh, with funding being in Switzerland. So there's yeah, no real criteria. They can be the best in the world and they can still come to Switzerland should they wish. They just have to perhaps pay more than the other guy, depending on which uh, nation they're from. And, you know, we try and keep the keep the group as as uh, flavoursome as possible, I suppose <laughs> you want to say. So we've all, always got fresh athletes coming in and um, creating a different stimulus in training and creating a, a nice competitive environment. Okay, so quitting for Jair is not an option. I, it would be it would be sad if if it if it was an option. Um, I really hope it isn't an option. I'd certainly be keen to work with him through until Paris, uh, just to see what he can really achieve. Okay, I think I think it will go like what he is wishing, and what we in Suriname also are hoping that he will be there in Paris. Yeah, let's hope so. And, you know, I, I, I guess this is um, it's big news for Suriname to have a result like this at the Olympic Games. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm sure we can, between us, we can muster some, some backing, whether that's financial or otherwise. And 
uh, really get behind Jair.